Hi, today we'll be working more on the planks and side planks, but we'll be doing it on the floor this time. Starting in a cat position, knees directly underneath the hips, heel of the hand directly underneath the shoulders, round out into your cat. Separating the shoulder blades, pushing the floor away with those hands and tilting the pelvis without gripping the glutes. Inhale, come back to neutral. Shoulder blades are anchored toward the back pockets of your pants, spreading the fingertips, reaching the fingers in front of you there. And exhale, round out in that cat again. Inhale, come to neutral. Exhale, round it out. Inhale, neutral. One more, exhale, round. And inhale, neutral. Moving into a plank. We're gonna be on our forearms for the first plank. So you can either clasp your hands together like this, pushing the fists into the floor, or palms flat. Starting in the cat, round out. Push the palms into the floor as hard as you can. And while you're here in this scoop, shoulder blades shrug down now. So now the shoulder blades are hugging in. They're no longer apart from each other. Reaching your left leg back, or if you feel more comfortable starting with your right, go ahead. Flexing the toes underneath you, sending your heel away. Then, once you have your abs scooped, bring your right leg to meet your left. Keep scooping those abs and holding here for five breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Pull the navel away from the floor and scoop those abs. Inhale. Exhale. Pushing the palms down into the floor more to almost lift your chest a little higher. Inhale. Exhale. Press the sternum toward the ceiling. So you're still rounding out in that mid back. Inhale, exhale, squeeze and lace the ribs together in the front. Inhale, and exhale, reaching the heels back as far as they can go. Come on down into child pose. Sit back on those heels and press your chest through your shoulders. Take a deep inhale here. Exhale, come back to your hands and knees. Going into a plank on your hands, if you feel uncomfortable with the wrists, you can roll your mat up like this and put the heel of the hands right at the edge so the fingertips are over. From here, round out like a cat. Reaching that left leg back. Reaching the right leg back. Scoop the abs and line up from the shoulders to the heels. Nice diagonal. Push the floor away from you. Widen the collarbone. Soften the elbows. Shrug the shoulder blades back and down. Your abs should be fighting to hold on here. Scoop the lower abs. Reach the heels toward the floor. Lengthen the back of the neck. Zip up in the pants. And two more breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Next inhale, we're gonna exhale, push those hips up to the ceiling, press the palms down into the floor and try to press the heels into the floor, bending the knees a little. This is the real down dog position. You're sending your chest toward your knees and round back into that plank. Inhale here. And exhale, send the hips back up to the ceiling. And round back to cat. And back to child pose. Going into side plank. So you're gonna be on your forearms here. On your left side, mirroring me. Your legs are slightly stacked. And you're pressing your right hand onto the floor, left forearm, fingertips pointing towards us. Inhale here and just exhale, squeeze those inner thighs together, lifting your hips up. And inhale lower. Exhale, lift. Try to get a straight line from your shoulder to your hip. 
Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Last one, exhale, lift. Extend the arm to the ceiling if you feel safe. Push the forearm through the floor and little hip pulses up. 10, nine, eight, seven. Squeeze those inner thighs together. Four, three, two, and one. Lowering down, swivel those legs around to the other side. Right hand on the mat, forearm <clears throat> parallel to the edge of the mat. Legs slightly stacked, so the left leg's on top and in the back. Left hand is on in front of your belly here. Squeeze and tweeze those inner thighs together and lift the hips for four. And lower. And three. And lower. Straight line from your shoulder to your knee. And lower. And one. And hold. Tweeze those inner thighs a little more. Extend the arm to the ceiling. That long wingspan feeling. Little pulses. Ten. And nine. Eight, seven, you should feel this oblique. Five, four, three, two, and one, and lower. And you're finished.